well, for me it's Saturday. Um, it is Saturday, I am headed to Under Canvas Smoky Mountains. It is a four hour drive from where I live, but it is going to be an incredible venue for this couple. Um, and I now have three back-to-back -back weddings at Under Canvas, like three weekends in a row. So it's a trek, but um, I am so happy that it's driving distance from our place. It's just gonna be an awesome weekend. We are gonna kick it off with a Western welcome party um, for them tonight, and then tomorrow will be the wedding. So in this case, it is a Saturday welcome party and a Sunday wedding. Uh, but normally we would arrive on Friday, do the wedding Saturday, and head out on Sunday. So I will take you behind the scenes as much as I can Right now, it's gonna be four hours of me sitting, listening to maybe an audiobook, my water bottle with my um, liquid IV hydration pack in there. I like to start that definitely before the event starts because once the event kicks off, I do get uh, very little time to drink water, or I, at least I don't think about drinking water. So, um, I will say. Camp, you gotta pick your bed. Yes, <laughs> this is embarrassing. <laughs> nope, it's still rolling. <laughs> yeah, you know, people hire us for wedding planning, not for tents. You're putting opening. me under pressure. <laughs> okay, I'm leaving. <laughs> oh, cute. I love it. We have room for a guest, whoever wants to join. Yeah. I love that they added fireplace. So it used to be that it was tens of four single beds, but we would freeze at night. So the little fire, not fireplace, but stove is really cute. Yay. Once we've unpacked our stuff in the room, we are heading over to the rental company and uh, just making sure that everything is there from the order and that we can start setting up for the rehearsal dinner. Okay, so trying to figure out where the ceremony will be. Um, the reception is on the platform and normally the ceremony is there. So we are just trying to find level ground over here. Katie and Gabe would like to have the woods behind them, which I agree, but there is a little bit of a slope. So thinking we do guest chairs here and have our couple maybe go up the hill a little bit for their ceremony. This would be their backdrop. I think that's pretty. All right, loading in the bar. We got our table set up for the rehearsal welcome party. It is going to be Western theme. So wait until you see everybody's outfits. Super casual, we're not doing any um, decor, maybe some flowers, but no place settings or anything. And then we are using some of the chairs out here for the ceremony uh, rehearsal. And then we'll set the rest up later tonight um, to be ready for the ceremony tomorrow. And then we've got Alex. Hey Alex! <laughs> I'm doing my behind the scenes video. Yeah, yeah, no, you're all in it and there's Sean. Hey Sean, hey Alex. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs>
It's wedding day for Katie and Gabe. We had a very successful welcome party last night and our florist is here. The details are gonna be so good. So on the wedding day, we're going to do a flip of the space. We're still going to keep the tables on the platform, um, but we're going to do a completely different layout than we did for the rehearsal dinner. And we're just going to set up the ceremony and start putting decor up. <music> setting up name cards here I want to make sure I tell you that the bride designed her entire wedding so we have no credit to take for that we were just executing her vision but she is a wedding planner herself and she came up with this incredible design that you'll see it's like boho modern and fun and just like so so cool so we um, loved making this vision come to life for her but it is all her oh my god reception decor
guests are in for a treat tonight. Now that reception is set, it is time to line up our bridal party. Sometimes it's like herding cats, but this group actually listened really well. All our guests are seated and we are ready to send people down the aisle. I didn't get any ceremony footage, but here is our wonderful couple, Katie and Gabe. After the ceremony, they went and did some sunset photos and look how good they look. One of my favorite parts of weddings is the cocktail hour. I feel like that's just the perfect time to let loose, have a cocktail, enjoy the sunset. We had a live painter um, that was setting the scene. We have time to light all the candles and just get ready for the dinner and dancing. Mm -hmm. 